I'm Lana Zak. Thank you for joining us. The CBS News Weekender starts now. Armed gang violence in the island of Haiti is causing even more tragedy. Two American missionaries, a young couple, are some of the latest victims. There will be some days this summer that we will likely see three million travelers in our screening checkpoints across the country. It's Memorial Day weekend and millions of people are rushing to their destinations. We'll check in on one of the busiest airports in the nation. Plus, a warning about swimming as the summer season gets underway. I speak with Olympic gold medalist swimmer Cullen Jones about his mission to keep people safe. We want to get people to understand the importance of learning to swim and give our, our young swimmers the tools to be successful. But first, if you're hitting the road, taking to the skies or boarding a train this holiday weekend, you are not alone. Early trends are revealing a historic number of Americans traveling for the holiday. AAA projecting that there will be 43.8 million travelers and are doing everything that they can to avoid delays and complications. We are anticipating crazy traffic, so we are going to leave earlier than we normally would just to account for that. Everything I heard was that this was gonna be an insane weekend to travel, so uh, we tried to book everything in advance on that side and get tickets in advance. You're gonna be in a bumper to bumper. CBS News New York reporter Jennifer Bisram joins us now from JFK Airport in Queens. So Jennifer, it actually looks a little bit tame, if I dare to say that. What's the scene look like for you? 